I want to talk with you a moment about family marketing because I think family marketing is one of the most exciting areas ever uh, and it's particularly exciting right now. Now you might wonder what I'm talking about because it might look on the surface like the traditional family is gone. In fact, there there's some folks who might uh, bemoan that and think maybe that uh, um, you know I wish things were like they used to be. You know, there, there's uh, divorces, there's uh, all kinds of arrangements and people separating in various ways and, and uh, uh, blended families. There's a lot of things that are very different than they used to be. But what that presents for marketers like you is a tremendous opportunity because what it simply means is that there are more people to market to and there are more interests to address and there are different kinds of families to serve. So I don't want you to underestimate the, the power of this and the importance of this as a marketer. You know, when you can look in a household and you can see that it's multi-generational or you can see that there are varied interests, or you can see that there's um, uh, uh, a different perspective from uh, the, the young person and the older person in terms of, you know, what a family should be like. Um, even the way holidays are celebrated is different. The way people live, the way they cohabitate is different. Um, you have folks who are couples and they only see each other on the weekend. They commute in order to see each other. There's all sorts of interesting arrangements. I remember once being on a, on a plane. I was sitting next to a gentleman and he was talking about the fact that he only sees his wife a couple of times a month because they work in different cities. Uh, and I've even seen that in different countries. So, you know, all of this establishes what could be a really exciting opportunity for marketers. You know, look at that family and say, okay, how can I serve them better? What do they need? What kind of uh, ideas do they need to bring these generations together? What kind of products do they need? How do they celebrate the idea of family more? How do they understand their differences and uh, negotiate, if you will, those differences better? How do you find a way to keep continuity as a family where everyone is all over the place doing various things? In fact, today, many people move from one city to the next. There's a lot of movement going on as well. So I don't want you to underestimate the power of family. We really had a great time at Taylor Insight working with uh, marketers who are focused on families and finding new creative ways to market their products and services and interesting ways to talk to those audiences. I want you to think about the same because family marketing is more important than ever and family marketers must be more creative than ever.